Welcome back to a new adventure of Red Dead Redemption. Last time we met Seth and he is crazy. We also had our first wagon race, which I really do hope we're not going to get that again. Although I am afraid that we do have it again, but it was absolute disaster. Um, so uh, fingers crossed. <laughs> Anyway, we're going to jump right in because we have loads of things to do. So without further ado, my name is Sharona. Welcome to my channel and let's go. Dude, calm down, man. Where you going? Where you going? Jesus Christ. Where you going, man? I was going crazy. Okay, we're back. Dun, dun. Okay. He was awful rough to me. Why can't all men be like you? A man's pride can make him do crazy things. If it ain't me, it's someone else. Well, find my blessed mother. What a start. Okay, hello. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> oh. No. I, I was just wanting to check what is that have I seen that before is that uh... okay yeah I was thinking that was gonna be a bounty thing I got iron to shoot right. hello hello there you surely won't regret a purchase you hear Jeb Murphy at the gun shop lost his well, gun look at you. Nice doing business. That's what I need. That's what I need. Remember to return. Thank you, What kind of girl do you take me for? These horses in this in this game are freaking crazy, man. I don't even know where my horse is, and to be honest, I don't really care because. We're gonna go to Marshall Hanging Bonnie. What? Come on, let's ride hard to Hanging me. Bonnie? Excuse me. Spoiler See, alert. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Are you happy now? No, I ain't happy at all. And I already told you, I ain't with the government. Now you say that, John, but the only thing I know for sure is who sent you. They made me come here, they gave me no choice. That's your federal government, Mr. Johnson. They come down here dressed as cocky as the King of Diamonds, talking a lot of flannel about helping us, about spreading peace and civilization to the West, but they brought nothing but trouble and taxes. I agree with you. Wolves in cheap clothing, all of them. Rob you, then make you pay to have someone it's investigate the crime not on me. your behalf. People around here have been fooled into feeling protected when they're worse off than they were before. The fellas I know don't care about people. All they care about is lying in their pockets. Why is this sorry son of a bitch so important to them? Norman Deke Williamson, right hand man. In other words, a glorified errand boy. Wait, Marshal! I'll be back for you! Bill Standards have slipped. We already filled you with lead once. That's the kind of man who's mean enough to be second in command, but too cowardly and stupid to ever be a leader. Don't ever use that line near your deputies. You know? For his sake, they'd best not have laid a finger on Miss McFarland. What is this place we're headed? Tumbleweed, oh. lonely godforsaken place. Some she people has say to it's do haunted. With it. it was quite a town back in its day. Then they built the railroad to Armadillo and went clean past Tumbleweed. And that was that. Pretty soon everybody had up and left. Now it's just thieves, smugglers, and bandits. Scum like Deke here. Oh, popular spot for lynchings, too. Let's try to avoid that if we can, Marshal. I just hope you're not taking advantage of the McFarlane's, Marston. They saved my life. Gave me food and bed when they had no exactly. idea who I was. I owe them more than I can ever repay. That's just they've been through a lot. Well, they're both vulnerable. 
different ways. I wouldn't have been running in and out of a burning barn to save their horses otherwise. I know you helped, just like you helped me. But you got your reasons for doing it. It's no secret why I'm here, Marshal. I told you the very first time I walked into your office. I trust you. It's just all this business with Blackwater and Williamson in the past. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard not to have doubts. I understand. I never planned to be in the lawman business neither. <laughs> No, it's no good fit. How is this mess supposed to turn out? Sending an outlaw to do the work of a lawman. That's madness. Ain't much difference between the two, as far as I can tell. There have to be rules, Marston. Even you must understand that. It's easy to make up rules, but they ain't much use if people don't understand why. Like my son. If I tell him not to do something, he'll do it anyways, just to spite me. If I punish him, he resents me for it. But if I show him why it's wrong, at least he has reason not to do it again. That's nonsense. Without laws, we're He's not very in. right. If you tell like your here. kids not to do something, they will do it. Man has worked hard at civilization. Your boy steps out of line, you whack him. He does it again, whack him harder. <laughs> okay. You're a good man, Marshal. And I respect what you're trying to do. From what I've seen since I've arrived here, the law ain't really working. Criminals are like weeds, Marston. Which you stomp one out, another one sprouts up in its place. The nature of places. You know that as well as I do. I can't wait for you to meet the boy. <laughs> oh dear. But I feel like I've. I hope that was water yet. I ain't had my turn. I feel like I completely missed a part of the story because. Boys, we get last broken on me. <laughs> Across the bridge. Not far to go now. The last time I saw Bunny was with the fire. And she was fine. Did they take her yeah. or something? I feel like I missed a whole part of the storyline. <laughs> John, you'll be exchanging the prisoner for Bonnie in the middle of town. Keep your eyes open. I sincerely doubt these scum When they've taken there. Bonnie? When did they do that? Besides, Norm here is going to be my shield, ain't you, Norm? <laughs> It'd be my pleasure. John, you lead Deke into town and make the exchange. Oh. I'm sure it's been nice for the boys. I don't understand. How the did they take Bunny? Hey, yo, move your bum. Oh, yeah. I hear those rancher girls like it in the rig. Get your, get your bum moving, man. Maybe she won't want to go home. She's been fucked so good. Why don't you save some of that breath for free? Come on now, boys. Cut me loose. Where's Bonnie? I thought we... Fire! Oh, Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Trying to shoot the rope. Get away from her. I'm just I'm lay a finger on her.
heck did that happen, Bye, man? Are you okay? I'm fine now, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> what the hell took you so long, you stupid man? Well, you weren't exactly helping me. <laughs> if you think I'm gonna lower myself by making a joke about being all tied up, you got another thing coming. <laughs> Come on. <clears throat> <clears throat> Holy shit, man. That took me by surprise. What the fuck? You don't need that anymore. Need you now. Exactly. What the fuck, dude? When did that happen, man? Uh, let me uh, look for something nice. Because... Probably there will be something around here, no? Were the birds eating? Were the birds going to eat him? Thank you, sir. Thank you. I was so busy trying to save her. <laughs> Not even looking what the other ones were doing. Holy cow! We're starting this episode with a banger, eh? So, someone said that. There's always at least one chest. Well, let's find it. But it seems to be very empty here, so I'm not sure if there's gonna be a chest over here. Hello? See shit, man. Is this something? Nope. Nope. I don't think there is anything around here. Unfortunately. Because it looks like good potential. Oh well. So did I just miss something of the whole story? Or is this just how it goes? Like... So suddenly. Because there was no notice about Bonnie being taken or I just completely missed that. But I doubt that. I don't think I've missed that. Why there is nothing in this place, man? Hey. <laughs> we found it. Thank you, sir. There we go. All for that. Well, it's fine. Is this my horse? No, it's not my horse, you see? There, 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 there he goes. There, stop it, stop it, stop it. That's it. Well done. Okay. Oh, wrong one. Don't go away, stay here now. There we go. Let's go. John Marston. Okay. 
Where where are we going? Mm, should we go here? Irish. That's a new one. Let's do a new one. Maybe maybe that'll be fun. Okay. Oh. Loot. There we go. Oh, there's another one. Hold on. Come there on, you go. What have we got here? Five go. whole dollars. Oh. Off we go. Irish. Honestly, just this game just keeps on surprising me and you guys keep showing me very fun facts about this game. Um, for one is that the, um, the farm uh, is supposed to be in... Um, is this the... F this farm apparently is in... Um, Red Dead 2. Is that the farm that we went to as John in the epilogue? Because the name sounds familiar, but I'm not quite sure. Also, I, I did this game, man. Like I said, it keeps on surprising me. Um, uh, you guys were telling me that um, in the first or the second episode, I was doing a side mission where I had to go to a house and either pay $200 or shoot the guy. I shot the guy and apparently the one... The voice actor for that one is um, the one that does Hosea as well. And Seth is the same one as Kieran. What the fuck, dude? That is so cool. I love those facts. And I love that they, they've used the same people. Seth and Kieran. What the fuck? Now, obviously, when I see Seth, I need to... I need to listen because I need to know if that's true or not. I mean, obviously, I believe you guys, but I want to hear. To see if I can hear it myself because I have troubles, okay? I have troubles with, with faces, with names, with voices. I, I am very bad at picking that up. Yes, boy, you messed up properly this time, didn't you? You little paddy bastard. You thieving <laughs> McCunt. You got it all wrong, Welsh. All wrong. It was French, I promise. He said he was going to rip you off. Now he's ripping me off. <laughs> Keep on talking there, Irish. In about 15 more seconds, your whole world's going to turn black. <laughs> What's up, boys? <sighs> Fuck off, boy. This don't concern you. When a man with a sing-song voice tells me to fuck off, it always concerns me, boyo. <laughs> Look here, this petty bastard stole our guns, tried to steal our horses. Law's clear on the matter. I never stole nothing, sir. Never did, not in all my life. That French cunt is playing with the Welshman's tiny and ineffective mind. Push your mind. <laughs> anyway, y'all got horses now. No one needs to die. Leave him be. Who do you think you are, boyo? The bloody cavalry? <laughs> <laughs> boy -o. This is really starting to get on my nerves, boy -o. <laughs> And you're getting on my nerves. Yeah. <laughs> Hold your man your own goddamn hold business. On, hold on, hold on. Oi! Oh shit! Are we shooting? I didn't know we were shooting! Hey, well, hold mister. on a minute. Oh <laughs> Hold on a minute. I was I was not paying attention. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> oh I suddenly forgot all the buttons. <laughs> Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Wait. <laughs> oh dear. I suddenly forgot everything that existed. You out the wrong hail. Oh, that worked. Mr. Nigel West Dickens said you'd help me locate a machine gun. Oh. 
think since I just saved your life. Oh, I can't thank you enough for taking care of those two degenerates. Uh, untrustworthy, poor in personal hygiene, lacking in the finer qualities of a, a gentleman. <laughs> uh, what about the gun? It'd be my pleasure. Uh, she's magnificent government issue. It'll be a bit of a ride, but we'll get there soon enough. Okay. Let's go. Uh, follow me, fella. <laughs> oh. Let's get this over with. The saloon's calling me. This is turning into a hell of a day. Hey! Hold on. Coming. There we go. What's your name, friend? John. I love John his Marston. accent. Stroke of luck you came along, fella. I thought I'd drunk me last breakfast there for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Who are those fine specimens of humanity? <laughs> they was the only friends in the world. And boy, am I glad to see them bastards dead. We all met on the boat over a few years back, we did. Kick his thieves ever since, and that right there was the problem. Is it normal for friends in Europe to drown each other? Never trust a Welshman, me pa <laughs> always told me. And he got his throat slit, so he should know. The kind of fellows who will steal an acorn from a blind sow and then kick her for squealing. And as for that French bastard... He didn't sound very French. Not for now. The Tevin bastards are holed up at the cabin by the lake. Can't I love how fast he's going. When we blast in there, they'll be more surprised than a slut dog with their first porcupine. You best not be lying to me. Listen, fella, I didn't ask for your help back there. I don't owe you nothing. I'll decide what you do and don't owe me. <laughs> I've had enough of your overly aggressive manner, fella. You don't know who you're dealing with here. Irish? I've met enough men like you to last me a Hold on! Two bit slut. Jesus! Snake. Meet at the cliff. Well, cliffs here. You can make quick work of those fellas if they give you trouble. The gun's stored just inside that shack. Okay. What about you helping me out? Uh, I'll cover you from the raid. <laughs> I'm better from long range. It'll be a piece of cake, fella. Trust me. Sure thing. And uh, do you want me to take them out, or uh, I can just barge right in? What the hell do you want? Hey! Take your gun. You got me madder than a wet hand. Back off now before I put a hole in your skull. Do you want me to God put a hole? I'll kill you, you son of a bitch. Punch it, girl. Oh, they're gonna use a gun. Go headshot. Come on. Oh, come on, that should be it. You're dead. You're dead. Okay. Well. There we go. What have you got? What have you got? Dum 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 dum. There we go. Dying son of a bitch. You must think I'm a Nancy. What? <laughs> you must think I'm a Nazi. Are you kidding me? No it's gun. Here. That lion sack of shit. <laughs> sack of shit. You kidding me, man? Where's the other buddy?
Tum tum tum. <laughs> Irish. Oh. Hello. Where's the bastard? Oh, wrong button. Irish! Where are we? Oh, he said it's really far away. It's not that far away. Where is Irish? Jesus Christ. Well. Let's go to Irish first and then we can go to Dickens. If that bastard has a bloody race for me again. Might as well. There we go. Hoppa. Let's have a look. Complete Twin Rocks hideout. Oh, we only need two things more. Capture or kill Mo Van Bar. Undiscovered outfits. Treasure hunter. Oh, there's a lot. Expert hunter. Harvest 500 pounds of meat. Kill a cougar. They have cougars here. With a stick of dynamite. Kill a skin. Eight snakes. I believe we have one. Kill the legendary jackalope. Oh, they have legendary animals in here too? How do we find those? Complete. Did, okay. Savvy merchant. Win $1,000 total from gambling. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Execute 20 people. Strangers or, or what? Or, or just random people. Oh yeah, we have the deers. Shoot and kill five flying wild birds. Well, that is not easy. Uh, um, that is not difficult. Okay. Fort Mercer challenge. Rescue the girl at Twin Rocks to unlock this challenge. Okay. Come on. Off we go. Are those wolves? Hey yo! I didn't see Let's it. Make this quick. Another one. This will fetch a good price. There we go. Wolf meat. Thank you. Wolf pelt. Tough one, ain't you? Wolf heart. Yuck. Last one. Last still. <laughs> there is a wolf nearby. Where are you? Huh? Can somebody tell me how to... We need a deer. Oh. In the bum.
Oh. Can somebody tell me how to equip your binoculars? Because I have no idea. I know that you have it in the game, but I don't know how. Hey! <sighs> Jesus. Just get the fucking shit out of me, man. In the mouth? Still alive? Come on, let's get this over with. Is he still alive? Oh no, he's dead. Oh, he should be. I shot him in the mouth. Oh, what were you eating? It's a lot of traffic, eh? I can still hear them, but can't see them. Horsey! Oh. Come on. Hello. Oh. Hey yo! Yeah. Now I should have the challenge done that took a lot of bullets <laughs> Listen, too guys. much should be the last one this is a messy one No? Still no? Well... Perfect. Finally another flower! Survival of the fittest? Did he say that? <laughs> sure, John. Now it should be done. Come on. Still no? But oh. Fuck is the difference between a buck and a deer? It's the same, no? Dude! How can you st <laughs> How can you still live, man? So, apparently I don't know what the difference, difference is between a deer and a buck. Buck or C, let's go. <laughs> Irish, I'm coming for you, mate. You set me up. There we go. Hey, bastard. Man is born. What? Irish. Where are you? Oh, I, who do you hunt? I, I see you. Get away from me. Right here. <laughs> Where's that machine gun, Irish? Oh, Mr. Marston. Uh, I, I found you one. Uh, found us one, Irish. We're in this together. You, me, and an assault on Fort Mercer. I'm the guy that saved you from getting killed back there. And who you owe your life to, remember? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Happens to me all the time. 
You don't want it to happen to you again, do you, Irish? No, I don't think friend. he minds. I wants to buy you a drink. I wants to tell you how much she means to me, how special he is. And I want to tell you that if you don't produce a Gatling gun within the hour, you'll wish you'd been killed back there. <laughs> it's the whiskey, sir. It gives me the memory of a newborn babe, as innocent as can be. Oh, there you go, John. And it makes me violently angry. <laughs> Shall we go look for that gun, sir? <laughs> yes. Let's do that. Uh. Not a feller to give up easily, are you? Well, you promised me that shit, so you should deliver. Yeah, you're finally there. Whoa! Jesus. And now you're gonna sprint. Come on. Oh, oh. Easy. Where are we going? I thought he was gonna sprint, so I already sprinted for him. You're not gonna pass out on me, are you, Irish? <laughs> me? No, I'm right as <laughs> rain. <laughs> or at least somewhere stuck between hair and Madeline. Well, you're gonna be stuck somewhere between dying and dead if you try to cross me again. It weren't like that at all, feller. Me intentions were pure. I swear it on me poor mother's life. I just gets a tad confused from time to time. Honest mistake. If there's any more confusion, I'll finish what your friends in Armadillo started. Jesus. Yo, what is happening with John, man? He is so Irish. I hear some angry. Miners about a machine gun they found. Apparently, they got it stashed up at Gap Tooth Breach. What do miners want with a machine gun? Shoot it at somebody, I suppose? Or sell it? I don't know. I've never been down a mine in all my life. Sounds real fishy to me, Irish. <laughs> I've just about had it with you and your game. You and Wes Dickens are so crooked, you can swallow nails and spit out corkscrews. Maybe if you was more cordial with folks, they might be better inclined to help you. I saved your life and you repaid me by lying, nearly getting me killed. Not fair now, Johnny. We should go around the side of Gap Tooth so the miners don't see us coming. I still don't know what miners would want with a machine gun. Miners are always spiky bastards. Spend too long without daylight and doxies and it starts playing with your mind. I never heard so much shit come out of one mouth. Only telling you what I heard. Oh, and we'll need a wagon or something oh my to get God, it out of John. there. That gun's heavier than sin. So how was I supposed to move it by myself last time? Two-faced little <laughs> bastard. <laughs> here we are. Let's stop here a moment. And get the this game is line. funny. This game is really funny. John is is very angry, but in a funny way. The entrance is plain to see, and there's a shaft them bastards used to haul out heavy ore. We, I mean you, can use that lift to get you and the gun to the surface. I do it all myself, but the mines play havoc with me sinuses. I'll find us a fine place to hide these horses, and then return with a borrowed flat wagon. I'll meet you at the mouth of the mine shaft. How Irish, do you trust him, I strongly mates? advise you don't run off this time. Hello. Hello. You're trespassing. State your business or move along. Okay. Kill that bastard! Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Horses. That did not go well. Sorry, horses. <laughs> oh, my dear. Where is he? Oh, <laughs> sorry. I'm not going to skin the horses. Thank you very much. Can I, um... Okay. I'll have to go here, I believe. Are you... Are you out of your goddamn mind? Who the hell are you? Well... Somebody there is gonna shoot you! When you come up... Go. 
he's still alive. Not any. That's, I, I was gonna say, not anymore. There you go. Come on. There you go. I understand how how it works, but we'll get there. Why don't you go get some bread? Even this up a bit. What? Hold on a second. Someone might as well have this. Exactly. I'm not gonna do all of them because I don't know if I have time for that. We have TNT. Hold on a minute. Okay. What? I'll shoot you seven ways? That man, hello. I don't see anything. I had you I had you dead <laughs> To the victor the spoil
Can go. Okay, that, 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 this is nice. I don't see anything. Do we need to go? How do we get up? Are you having fun yet? What did you say, sir? Trying to get the light, but I cannot. Are you okay? Got you now, man. Come on, man. I want the fucking lamb. That's it. Ah, there you go. Oh, we still have more. Jesus. He really still is not dead. How is he not dead? I was going to say, Jesus. Gone way faster, but oh. don't think you'll be wanting this no more, friend. Exactly, friend. Oh, oh no, I was trying to loot. That's okay. Now let's hope that the fucker is there. Grab on. Shit. Oh shit, okay. We're gonna have to shoot fuckers here. Oh fuck, oh no, this is not gonna go well. We are pushing them out. Oh, you will automatically jump on? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Come on. Come on, jump on, that's it, that's it. Oh, oh, no, oh, oh. Look at this. Oh, come on. <laughs> I... <laughs> I thought I'd be looking at your carps being hauled up this lift. Load up and I'll engage the gears. 
I thought we would have to shoot, but no. I'm I am surprised that he's there. Very surprised that he's there. I still don't trust him. Where you going? There she is. What a beautiful weapon. And now what? God's own gun. Ain't that the trailer? I got us a borrowed flatbed parked down there. Don't let go of her. She's a beast. Okay, now, now here we go. Now here we go. Bye. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Aww. What did I tell you? Piece of cake. That was way too short. That was a Let's lot go. of fun. A short we ride now, and we'll have this executive peacemaker delivered to Old West Dickens. Uh, some help, maybe. No, thank you. Appreciate Make sure it. Sure doesn't fall off on the way. Yeah. Pro you maybe should close. No. Okay. Cool. You, you do you, man. I'm gonna have a look. You are now somewhat known around the frontier. It now costs you significantly less to convince officers of the law to turn a blind eye. Okay. $14. Look at that. Do we have any more? No. No. Okay. That was really fun. I really wished that part with the with the rails thing was longer but no because that was a lot of fun i like that a lot the people in this game really don't like to uh oh i thought that was a chest man like to decorate their houses i mean obviously you they didn't have much in this time but nothing at all. Like such a big house and there is nothing. Can is there something in the cupboards? There's nothing in the fucking cupboards. I don't know. I w I'm just thinking about if someone were to suggest whether to play one or two first. I don't know what I would suggest, to be honest. I feel like maybe just start with one. Because then you're kind of used to the mechanics of the, of the game. And... I don't I don't think there's anything around here and you much more appreciate the things that you can do in two I think I don't know but story wise maybe two first pardon letter oh well I don't know I don't know plant there you are. Ooh, oh that is one we need for the challenge that's true okay where are we going I believe we're going to Dickens don't let me race and then we're going back to um, Come on. Irish. Oh no. oh no. Okay. I'll see you there. Let's go. Let's go.
Ma'am, are you okay? I thought I was a goner for sure. I'm With sorry. Pleasure, ma oh, are those cougars? Yeah, cougar meat. Oh shit, man. Now what are you doing out here alone, man, in the dark? In the fucking nature. desert. Crazy. Okay. Um, there's my horse. Horsey. Let's go. Here we go. Dickens. Don't let me do it. Can a swindler what? Mr. Marston, sir, John Marston. <laughs> what are you doing there, mate? Mr. Marston, don't be so childish. Come on, <laughs> sir, I implore you. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So I made a few innocent mistakes when last we met. But my plan is still sound. Together we can conquer, if not the world, and certainly Bill Williamson. But first, you need me to do you a favor? <laughs> You read my mind. I can only deduce you have been taking my tonic, sir, as instructed. It can give the most ordinary of intelligences a remarkable yeah, 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 insight. Yeah, 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 of course. I'll give you insight. I'll show you what your guts look like. Please, sir, this show of John! short of embarrassing. Think for a moment, sir. What is Think. happening, Think John? Think about how much of my time you're wasting. <laughs> um, sir, sir. I am about to do something which I greatly discourage in all wise and rational men. A selfless act for you. But sir, before I act selflessly, allow me to act selfishly and sell some of my wares. Fair enough. Oh, good sir. Come and let's go visit some of our fine friends in the other oil business we have here in Plainview. These men need all the help they can get. <laughs> Dickens, oh my goodness. The characters in this game are really funny. What is he doing? <laughs> what is it? Oh no. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Friends! Hard-working souls of uh, Plainview, do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute chronic sciatic, uh, neurologic or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article which cures headache, neuralgia, uh, toothache, earache, backache, swelling. This man is a fucking charlatan. He just got done swindling us down at Cho Springs with this song and dance. I say we tar and feather him right now. I say we shoot the uh, bastard. I think it's time we take our business elsewhere. Uh, I apologize if science is not your forte. Good day, one and all. Oh dear. Somebody get that thing. Oh. For Christ's sake, John, get on the damn wagon. St. Homer Bonus is not can you? I was gonna say, can you fucking drive, mate? You do it. Riding us in the passenger seat is also called I. We know how to rob banks. Drawing and fire. What? Shit. I missed it. One, two. <laughs> Dead eye is fucking ridiculous in this game, man. <laughs> Easier, though. There you go. Bye now. Yeah, that, that's gonna be now that I know how to use it. That's gonna be my new way of doing things. Bye. Sure is hard to keep along. More. 
Hello, hello. Oh, wrong one. Bye. No, that's not it. You just drive your fucking white. Look at him sitting. What? I don't know. I'd say the prettiest dude. Shit! You almost got me. Oh my god. Nearly. You can suit. Oh, okay. Where are. Where, where. Oh. He's driving. I am up against the weight of being ignorant, my boy. Defend the wagon as West Dickens drive. That, that's what I did. Maybe you need to think about a change of career. I will never give up on science. Not the horses. Dum, 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 dum. How do these people harbor such bitterness? Well, I ain't surprised. That tonic I drank yeah. at Ridgewood went through me like a dose of salt. Dickens. There he comes. Oh no. Shit. Dum dum dum. Those are a lot of angry people, eh, Dickens? Taylor, I'm not sure we're out of the woods yet. Shit coming from there, but I don't see anything. Oh, it's raining. I'm still waiting for them to appear. They're not coming. Hang in there, John. Not far now. Hurry up, man. I don't see shit now. I don't know where they are. Thank you, my dear boy. Harry. You saved the day again. As usual. It always impresses that was me fun. the speed with which a group of men can turn from Oof. passive sheep into murderous wolves. I'm impressed with how you nearly got us killed back there. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, perhaps we should shell the tonics business for a period. Let's say we try our hand at racing again. No. Meet at Ratskeller. No. Trying my patience, Mr. West Dickens. Well, I'm sorry, dear boy, but I'm only an aging vendor of exotic elixirs, not the bloody U.S. cavalry. And forgive me if matters take some time to prepare. I'm not racing. This is gonna be the fucking race, isn't it? <sighs> no. The sport. Mr. No. West Dickens! Ah! Mr. Marston! It's only How been ten seconds, you, sir. sir! How wonderful! 
Are we ready, then? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, nearly, sir. Barely nearly, sir. I just need some cash to get some extra hardware fitted to my old Trojan horse here. You, you what? Uh, never mind, sir. I can only presume that you have not enjoyed the benefits of a classical education, so I will not take umbrage Thank you. if some of my illusions sail over your head, sir. I won't <laughs> pretend to understand you, but I will endeavor to make you understand me. Either we do this right now, John is so angry. or I'm going to bullet in you and get on with my day. Please, I knew you were a violent man, Mr. Marston, but I did not think you were a stupid one. We need money to outfit my carriage. Is he so violent and angry vehicle. because of... Into something more... Of two? <laughs> and I'm about to tell you how we are going to gain said cash. Now I know that you ride very well. So come, sir. To Rathskeller for... No! Uh, Let's go, my dear boy. I'll show you the way. Yeah, I'll ride shotgun. Hey, hey! Gonna ride shotgun. Fuck's sake. So how are you, John? Okay, all things considered. Hopefully we can get through today without running into another army of your satisfied customers. Onwards and upwards! I refuse to let the blind stupidity of the proletariat derail <laughs> my calling in life. Nothing blind oh, about no. it. I'd say they saw right through you. Ah, before knowledge comes down, my dear boy. Everybody knows you're as crooked as a dog's hind leg, Wes Dickens. I resent that implication, John. I wasn't implying. I was telling. Oh, my you're God. You're such a successful businessman. What are you doing living in a cave? Delightfully Dickensian, isn't it? If you say so. Are you familiar with the concept of philanthropy, John? I'm surprised you are. Oh, I don't do any of this for myself, John. I hope you realize that. You're crazy, old man. You seem to be forgetting that I've been part of your ridiculous charade. Ah, oh, seeing a lame woman walk again. That's all the pay I need. It's been quite a ride, John, hasn't it? We haven't gone that far. No, I need us. Fitchwood Farm. Gap to Creek. You. We make quite a team, you and me. Brains no, we don't. We no, we don't. Partnership. This partnership ends no. I have Bill Williamson. <laughs> I appreciate your help. Exactly. I've just about had it with all your schemes. You need to realize <laughs> what's at stake here. I know, John, I know. Just win this race and we'll be ready. I give you my word. Yeah, you keep saying that shit all the time. And can I go already forward or do I need to wait for you? Because that's gonna take a fucking long time, man. Let's see if I can. Come on. Oh, we're here anyway, so. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh. Yeah. Is this just gonna be the horse? Because that's gonna be alright. Gentlemen. At least no wagon. No shooting. No shooting. No stabbing. Cliff pushing. Rock throwing. Cactus grinding. <sighs> Why are you ready? If it's just with a horse, you know, that's okay. Because I cannot bump into things. I can fall off, but I cannot bump into things. Which already makes it much better. Look, if it was in two, then I, I, I would have said no, because with Arthur, you can bump into things and, and, and very easily fall off and shit like that. But this is fine. If it's just me and the horse, that's okay. They're not tight corners. Shit! Oh, shit! No! God damn it, I didn't see the stone, man. You will not pass, I repeat. You shall not pass! Sorry. 
Are we there? Are we there? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Nope. So if you become second, do you have to do it all over again? Or you just... You failed the mission and you will have to do it again. Yeah, probably. That's a stupid question. Well, I say stupid things when I'm stressed. Okay? <laughs> and right now I'm really fucking stressed. <laughs> it's always funny when I watch myself back when I have to edit. Because I can see when I'm stressed, my shoulders going all the way up, and then when I finish, I'm like, <gasps> shit, they're on my back. Uh, are we done yet? Jesus Christ, what a long race, man. line is inside I repeat the finish line is inside do not make any mistakes come on let's go he came he saw he, he conquered, conquered. <laughs> what a fantastic spectacle John <laughs> thank you let's sir thank take you. a moment to bask in the glory of our victory have we got enough money now all right all right all right uh, yes, once Seth and Irish have furnished their side of the bargain, I think we should be ready. Quite a team we've assembled. Yeah, don't you very, think? very beautiful Bunko, team. A grave robber and a drunk. <laughs> How could things possibly go wrong? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, we have a stranger. It's going well. Blackjack games can now be entered. Well, I don't know how to play blackjack, so that's gonna be... Any good at tossing horseshoes? I've never seen what? <laughs> what is this? What the fuck is happening there? I, I just need to know what this is. Who are you to judge? Horseshoes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Good morning to you, dear sir. Greetings. Tossing a horseshoe is controlled by the point of release. You can send a horseshoe farther by choosing a lower release point. What? Look at you. You can fine tune the distance by pulling your arm back less. Okay. So it's kind of like Patanka. Which is um, jeu de boule, <laughs> jeu de boule. Um, to toss a horseshoe, pull are up and down. You can aim left. Ah, ah. Oh, oh. Uh, I'll release. Okay. Hold oh, no! <laughs> on. Let me do it again. Hey, okay. Okay. No, I want to do it again. <laughs> Enter your bed. Bed. What? Let's start um, with two. Now you are playing for money, okay? Hey! <laughs> Nearly, sir. This is fun. Oh, I like this. Okay. Oh. You sure can play them things. Oh. Oh. I have 
one point. Look at that. First to 11. 11 wins. Okay. Oh, this is fun. I like this. It's just someone is is crying like a crazy in the back. Okay. Uh, oh! Oi! Nearly! Nearly! Oh, come on, man! Okay. And it, that's pretty hard. What the fuck is happening there, man? Oh! Oh yeah. Okay. Let's uh, <laughs> try this again. Go like a bowl in a china closet. Oh, go ya. It's it's hard. Yeah, I, I am ridiculous. As usual, disaster. One point for me. <laughs> what are you aiming at? <laughs> Chum. I would love to play this game in real life. That's fun. Okay. Let's see. That's oh! Points in the pocket, in my pocket. <laughs> Nearly, sir. That woman crying, Jesus Christ. Okay, there we go. Aim. Oh. That way. And now. Oh. Oh. Wrong. Uh. Oh, yeah. You sure can't fling them things. How many points do you get if you if you hit it? Do you like immediately win the game or you get like five points or what? Oh! So close. I'm gonna win. I only need three more points. He still needs like seven or eight or... Oh, well oh, wrong. oh, oh, sir. Nearly. Yeah, wait, sir. Let me finish my game, man. How close! Look how close! Oh. 
Woman, can you stop crying, please? Oi! Okay, I need two more points and then I've won. Well, seem to as he didn't even hit the this area. I'll I'll shoot win. That's how you throw a horseshoe. Oi! I thought they was in. Well, two points. I win! Yes, I've been beat. Oh, that was really fun. Oh, I like that game. Okay, what the fuck is happening here? <laughs> hey, partner, I need your help. You and every other fool around here. No, they took her. They took my love. They stole Jeff's heart and they, they took her away. What, what are you talking they about, friend? They took my love. They took Jeff's loves by them gangsters. They hide out of tumbleweed. <laughs> can you help me, partner? Partner, can you help me? <sighs> I doubt it. But if I head up that way, I'll see what I can do. Help a fella out, partner. I have a soul. <laughs> I thought it was a woman crying. Where is the guy? <laughs> But what are we looking for? Jeb's love. What is that? Oh no. Oh no. Hello. 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 I want to pet you. I cannot pet the freaking dogs. Oh, I'm all the way here. Oh. Um, why we have two? Funny man. Oh. Who are you to judge? Is that the one that we're doing now? Probably. Okay. Off we go! And then we go to Irish. Irish! Oh, Irish! This gang hideout is deserted. Okay, but I need to go here, man. I don't know what deserted means, but... Oh. No! I need to go down here. Yes. Hello. Yeah, such a sweet sugar. What you doing here, mister? I've come for you. A mercy mission. Your poor wretch of a man lost his mind. I've seen him at Raskeller Fork. Uh, my man? My man's dead. Lawman shot him about a month ago. Shot him in the back, coming out of a cat house. Gave himself his medals. Just like I gave myself to that poor bastard. Unless you've been to hell, you ain't seen no man of mine. Then where is she? Who? Jeb's girl. Who's Jeb? Creepy kind of guy. Short black hair. Mustache. <laughs> oh, my, oh, my. <laughs> this is Lucy. This is Jeb's girl. I knew it was not a woman. Dumb fool. <sighs> Took it off him about a week ago. Hmm. Then you better come with me. <laughs> yeah. We better get her back to her man, huh? You gonna made my day. What a fine romantic you is. <laughs> well, come on, man. All right, I thought she was me. gonna shoot me. Um, oh. What is the best way? to go here. <laughs> um, this way. It's gonna go here. You should have seen the look on your face, 
mister. I bet you thought you was being a real hero. I should never have listened to that crazy fool. Mercy mission. Ha! So did Jeb offer you some kind of If you continue, the woman and Lucy no, will travel I'm alone. Just helping him out. Well, ain't you the sweetest thing? I'm just like you. A real sweetheart. Let's go. Easy. I Jesus. gotta ask, mister. Didn't Jeb strike you as being kind of funny? Most people out here strike me as being kind of funny. <laughs> yes. But Jeb, he's a special type of funny, I'd say. I'm inclined to agree with you, miss. <laughs> he got you good, mister. I'm glad you find it so amusing. to go back to your special man. Miss, are you speaking of that horse? This is weird. <laughs> well, Jeb sees something in her, doesn't he? You think he's gonna have flowers waiting for her? There's some things I'd rather not think about. Mister, I gotta thank you. I'm gonna remember this one for a long time. What is happening? Whoa, whoa. Come on. Reunite Jeb and Lucy. Okay. Hello. Mister, Mister, you found her, Mister. Oh, I found her, all right. Come here, girl. Come to Daddy. Oh, you're so beautiful. I'm so strong, yet such a lady. I long to hold you. I missed you so much. You got problems, friend. Oh, I ain't got no problems. Not now that she's back with me. Oh, I remember a cold night that we spent together. Every night's been cold without you, my sweet thing. Oh. I thought I was sick in the head. I told you he was funny, mister. Life out here does that to people. Oh. I should know. Look at the my horse floating. Goats. Kick him. Oh. That was some weird shit, man. Are you okay? I thought I thought the woman was gonna shoot me. Oh, we had several things open. Where is everything? Oh, Jesus Christ! Irish. Do we only have Irish? Come on. Oh. Okay. We don't, I'm not gonna do blackjack. I'm very sorry, but I'm not doing it. We have a very long way to travel all the way to Irish. And that's the only thing we have open. So, uh, I mean, we have funny man here. But... We will go to Irish. And I need to go the other way. Why why do I need to go the other way? Yeah, you know what? Thank you. Hello. Okay, so because it's a very long way. You okay? The fuck? <laughs> so freaking random. Okay, because we need to go a very long way. I will see you when we arrive there. And if I find something interesting, obviously I will let you know. But other than that, I'll see you there. I believe. Let's go. Let's go. 